is part of the Frog Pants Network. Get more at frogpants.com. Diamond Club hopes you have enjoyed this broker. <laughs> I was putting a secret edit point in there. That's why there is a delay. Uh, thank you again, Tim. I know you're way busy, so by all means, if, if you need to take off, take off now. Yeah, I need to. Uh, yeah, Bloomberg going. So thanks very much for having me. Always a pleasure. Good yeah, thank you, so thank you so much. Have, have, have a good day. Have a safe right. CES. Thank you. You too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, it's going to be real safe with all that bag checking, I'll tell you. Uh, uh, yeah. uh, well, I the good news is that I've taken all of my usual backpack full of gear and reduced it to a purse. I don't wow. know how that's going to hold tomorrow, but we'll see. Nice. Um, well done. Yeah, we'll see. That's that's before I got to get Patrick Norton on the air. So I don't know. Uh, let's see what else. Oh, so uh, the number one title right now is Alexa, where are my keys? Which actually, I'll tell you what. If it could answer that question, that would be great. If the like the fob could talk to the echo, that would be awesome. I'm sure it, it could at some point. I like I like a car electronics show as well, but mm, that is yeah, it's a yeah. little bit yeah. All right, voice. fine. You don't like my what I like. I I'm gonna leave. I, <laughs> if I've learned anything from the Phileas Club, it's that I don't want to hang around with anyone who's different than I am. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> uh, uh, no, car electronics show is I'm, I'm good. Actually gonna leave, I like though. it. Oh, okay. you're actually gonna leave. Okay, yeah. fine. Yeah. <laughs> no, you, I, and he's like, no, and I really am pissed. <laughs> uh, it's so good to see All you, right. Patrick. You too. Thanks All right. so much. Happy New Thank you. Have, Take care. Have Happy New Year. Have a good time. And Jenny, good luck with the rest of Crazy Town. Bye, oh, chat yeah. room. Bye, everyone. Um, yeah, so I... Um, this, we've been very low on titles lately. Where are all the title masters? Where have they gone? Where have all... The title's gone. Oh, wait, I think oh um, I think uh, what's it? Showbot Reminder has not been in the chat room doing his reminding. Oh, I see. Boom. Hey, Ellie. Ellie's got a title. Ellie's I, got a title. Alexa, where are my keys? NVIDIA, update your car's drivers. Huh? Huh? Mm -hmm. Car electronics show. I don't know. I still like Alexa, I think. And I'm sorry that I've now set off. We've all set off your Amazon Echoes in the post show. I know. I at least didn't do it in the real show. Yeah, so no, I, that, like I think that's fair. That at some point, really. I was like doing such linguistic circles around it too. Like that nice lady I talked to in my house. <laughs> um, Sam's. I'm still looking at Samsung. Oh, they're trying to. It's, I don't know. It's hard to look at these from. Uh, a live stream. There are so many people that are live blogging Samsung, but they all have video elements too. Mm -hmm. And so every time, uh -oh. I, think we <laughs> I think it was an example of what at, happens. Yeah. All of a sudden, there was Brian Cooley. Like, I'm Brian Cooley, and I'm talking about things. And I was like, That's great, but I just need to look at your <laughs> Love live you, Brian blog. Cooley. Just need to know what's happening in Samsung. Please, I, you're the best, but just please stop now because well, there's I the need Tab to look Pro at S, crazy yeah. thin Windows 10 2 in one. Yeah. Hey. Uh, super light notebook nine series laptops. I feel I feel like CES has gotten to the point where a laptop announcement just is not. It's like a PDA yeah. announcement was ten years ago. Like, mm, mm, mm. yeah. Mm. I like Ellie's trenchant commentary. What's that? I enjoy Ellie's trenchant commentary. Is it is it Trenton like? Yeah, I said trenchant. <laughs> oh, oh, I see. But I think also the wireless is getting less good. No, no, you you were fine. I was just being stupid. Okay. I was, you know, you're from the East Coast, so I thought maybe <laughs> something about Trenton that I didn't it's realize. Real Trentonish. Come back, live blog, come back. Hmm. 
Hmm. All right. Well, I like that. You like what? Uh, to uh, get do away with the difference between apps and input which is to say it will be as easy to go from TBS to HBO as it is TBS to Netflix. Oh, this is the Samsung TV. Yeah. Yeah, we already talked about that. Yeah. I'm still waiting. That's yeah, the but no, thing. It's, they're yeah. still doing the, here's some things we told you. Yeah. But no, I like it. I like the way, it, I like the way they did it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I was kind of like, I don't think I like this Samsung TV thing with the interface and the remote until I was like, oh, it automatically recognizes devices. Oh, yeah. oh, it just like puts everything in one interface. That's kind of cool. And yeah. Like, it Picture's one ups the cool. harmony there. Yeah, I like the picture that they just took. Because that is a weird, like sort of archaic thing. The, uh, what, the, the remote? Well, yeah, or like having six remotes and having to go like, uh, okay, wait, so I can't get the, you know, like so many devices and so many apps and you can't get the Amazon on the Apple TV yet. So that, that means I got to go to the PlayStation yeah, and that's right. an input. Like that's a Even lot. Even with the Harmony, you have to remember where it is, right? It, right. It, that, that solves that problem of like, oh, just take me to my Amazon app, wherever it is. Yeah. All right, this is guaranteed to break somebody's podcast app. I'm almost certain. Oh, boy. Because uh, it's got three different post-show elements plus the uh, – I, I tried to put the – because there were so many post-show elements, I wanted to put the frog pants and the stinger, Diamond Club yeah. stinger, at the a actual end. Yeah. It says that it's mono 44100, so – that's what ought I did to, mine is. It ought to work. All right. Tom Merritt, Patrick Beja, Jenny Josephson, and Tim Stevens. It's a big cast. Yeah. Um, question. Yes. Will you, do you feel like you'll want somebody from CES on Thursday? Or will you kind of be over it from a discussion point of view? What do we got? We got Justin again on Thursday, right? Yeah. Um, I wouldn't say no, but it's not something I'm like, we got to get somebody. Yeah. Because you know I mean? I'm out of here. I'm, I'm flying out early Thursday. Yeah. So. No, it's, it's the show begins Wednesday. It's basically over then. Yeah, I know. I know. <laughs> it sounds terrible. But I it know, becomes, but it's always it true. It becomes the province of the, it becomes an actual trade show on Wednesday yeah. through Friday. That's, the that's kind of it, right? And, and I think yeah. in some ways that's really smart for CES to be like, let's get the press out of here yeah. <laughs> so that we could all do our Leave jobs. people, get out. Uh, yeah, so Thursday, I was almost wondering if we should invite Carboni on Thursday. Is he and there? No, he's not. But I, for oh. some reason, I was just like, let's just do a lighter like review of CES because it's all going to be goofy stuff by Thursday. Right. Yeah, hey. I can reach out to him. All right. I, it was weird. I, I was weird when you said that because I saw a guy somewhere that looked just like Anthony Carboni, and I was like, "Am I running into him again?" I don't think he's there. No, I saw I him talking with Scott Johnson on Twitter about drawing software. So, mm. yeah. So I think, uh, oh, there it is, hitting the wall, hitting the mid-afternoon wall. Um. What's the time in Las Vegas? At the same time as your time. I know it always it always surprised but me. But you feel for some like reason. you make a time change. You feel yeah. like you make a time change because, like, things are happening at seven in the morning. Mm -hmm. And, and I, at midnight. Yeah, like, and at midnight. Right. Uh, my dinner reservation tonight is at nine forty-five p.m. That's you're dinner. like a Spaniard. Yeah. So late. I'm like I'm gonna be asleep in my pudding. So we'll see. Are you gonna get pudding? I don't know. I'm going to a place. I don't know where am I going anyway. I like pudding. I want some pudding. I want pudding. <laughs> I have rice pudding in the fridge. That's about that as sounds pudding. good. Oh, no. I also have those sugar-free Jello pudding pots. But ever since the Bill Cosby thing, I don't want to eat them. Oh. Mm. Uh, farm, to table, farm to table menus, which makes me think there will definitely be pudding. 
Wait, where is this? Is this where you're gonna? Eat where do you today? grow pudding? What farm grows pudding? You grow corn, corn pudding. <laughs> can I? Can I? Can you tell me what farm this pudding came from? Indian pudding. pudding farm. Uh. I remember growing up driving through the fields of pudding. Yeah. Kansas plains waving with pudding, mile after mile after mile. What's interesting is it isn't pudding, only in the U.S. is pudding associated with dessert because, I guess in right. Britain, there's also. Salted roasted beets, roasted pear, Alaskan king crab. Sounds expensive. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, pudding is different. Pudding is a baked good in in the UK. Oh, slow poached organic farm like egg. Why can't I open this up more? <laughs> oh my gosh, there is pudding. There's a foie gras brulee. See? Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> wow. There you go. Not the pudding there's I was your, expecting. There's your pudding. It may not be the pudding you expected. Yeah. But it's the pudding the you deserve. Duck cruelty pudding. <laughs> yes. I just label it that. Yeah. Let's have honest, honest labeling. Ah, oh delicious God. cruelty. Uh, so oh, tasty. cruelty, thy name is tasty. I, uh, here we go. We try to load the menu. It's taking forever. Oh, still taking. All right, here we go. Um, yeah. Yep, yep. This looks pretty respectable. I'm not going to make it through this whole meal. Is it really farm to table? Just, uh, what does yeah. that mean? You know. I mean, if I'm actually eating out in the farm, then maybe, but. Yeah. So wait, where is this restaurant located? In the Aria. It's in, it's in a farm. It's in a farm. <laughs> it's in a water farm outside of Vegas. It's artisanal and It's American. run by Fremen. After a while, I kind of got tired of all the hotel restaurants. I don't know why. I think it was just because I kept running into CES people. Yeah. Let's see. Do you have a car or access to a car? That is the sound no, of CES not, right there. I know, right? Oh, I just hit the wall. You gotta go to the pepper you know mill. Because Molly, Molly would just texted me and said, "I just hit the wall," and I was like, "Oh, oh no!" Yeah, you she said triggered it out you. Loud. <laughs> now I'm like, "Oh." Yesterday she knocked you off the internet by walking in the room. I know. It was ridiculous. Like she walked in the room, and I was like, "Oh, hey, there's." <laughs> Mollywood broke the internet just by walking into my hotel room. That's expected behavior, though. Yeah. <laughs> yeah that's, that's a known right. issue. You're that's not, a known bug. <laughs> you're not doing any of the events tonight, are you? Oh, God, no. I never go to a single event. Are you kidding? I, we used to be signed up. It was nonstop. No, like those, you know, like, I did go to Unveiled. Like, I did go to that one because that's, like, small enough. But all those, like, shows stuff, like, Tom's point is so excellent, which is that that is why CNET is there. That is why The Verge is there. That is why all these people are there, is to do all that hard work with their staff of 50 to 100 people covering this event. Yeah. And for me, it's like, all right, what is the one pocketed, targeted thing I am going to go do today? I will go do that and well. You know, like that's my that has become my strategy as part of a what a grand total of three person show. Yeah, um, well, I mean, you could call the contributors a fourth. They make up. I know. Three. I always can I say yeah. So like, are we four or are we? I don't know. We're a few. Just we're a few. an eight person show. We're a several person show. Yeah, we're a few people. Less yeah. than ten. Um. So yeah. So that's I mean, my... then there's all the listeners and all the patrons. Well, then we are like a huge show. We're a countless. That's right. We're a legion. Well, if you want a place to eat that isn't that, there's always um, stuff off the strip. Pepper Mill. Go to, uh, what is it? We went here one time, the Jerusalem Grill. Mm. For SEMA. I'm going to Shake Shack. That's where I'm going. Oh, yeah. Oh, I forgot they had a Shake Shack, Shack right now. Well, no, I, no. Is it the Steak and Shake? Like, no, no, dude, no, it's Shake Shack. Shack. Steak and Shake is also good. You haven't been there forever. Yes, in a while. That's not new. Shake Shack came to Vegas. That's awesome. Um, so now apparently there are washing machines rolling across the screen or across the stage. Oh, they're doing their white goods now. Yeah, they're doing their appliances. There comes the fridge. Here she is. is. 
Mrs. Smarty Fridge. <laughs> She's got a seven inch screen. I will be impressed with a smart fridge if it has a built in milkshake maker. My milkshake brings all the so, fridge to the yard. Sorry. <laughs> Thank you. You got there first. <laughs> <laughs> it's just there. It was made for it. Exactly. <laughs> I'm sad I'm not in the chat room right now. <laughs> I couldn't get in. It was like too much. The Wi-Fi was like, nope. Well, I know that chat. No chat nope. room. Or something, a smoothie maker. Uh, something where you push and you get more than just water and ice. Yeah. You mean a frappin' fridge? Or like, yeah, so like on the door side, you load it up with like kale or whatever ingredients you need in the morning to make a smoothie. And yeah. then it just blends it right when you press the button. The only way to communicate with me is through showbot.tv. Suggest titles that are actually things to say to me. <laughs> we'll make that the chat room. She's become one with Showbot. Yeah. I only speak Showbot now. I only speak Showbot. So rainy, so rainy. Thank you, Ellie. I'm I'm bugging Molly for crashing you. She's like, what? <laughs> I'm not even there. <laughs> All right. Publish this piece of CES. Magic. <laughs> Magic. Exactly. Do that. <laughs> So 12 weeks is what? 12 weeks is uh, uh, three months, right? Yes. So effectively, yeah, we got a little money at the end of Vegas for a little over three months. If I just go based on CES and context. Yeah. I know. It's nice hearing Molly's voice on the end of the show, right? Yeah, it is. It's great. That was a fun little conversation you guys had. So yeah, go find that, it in the show notes or the treasure go chest, find it. folks. Uh, and that's it. We're we're published, publicitated, uh, and we're gonna all hit the wall now. Yep. Bye. <laughs>